everyone, this is Jagger here with Rusher's Toys bringing you a Jurassic World Jurassic Park 3 Amber Collection uh, Velociraptor unboxing. And I have to I have to say that I know I'm late to the party and doing uh, unboxing for the Amber Collection as now everything's going to the uh, Hammond Collection. But I wanted to show you guys this because this figure you can still order on Target as well as Walmart in Amazon. And this is my favorite Velociraptor that's ever been put out in the Jurassic Park, Jurassic World era, you know. And I mean, I, I love Velociraptor Blue, but there was just something with the Jurassic Park 3 Velociraptors that were just something else. And like, I love this package because you've got the Jurassic, the Jurassic Park 3 logo right there with the Spinosaur. And it just, it just changed the game. Jurassic Park 3, I know some people out there do not like the movie at all. And there's some people that just absolutely love it. And I mean, I was devastated when I went to the movie on opening day and I saw the T-Rex die right away. And I was like, what is this? But that movie was also an amazing change that was just so great too and the spinosaur was just the perfect big bad guy but um just looking at this package and bringing it back now you can see the jurassic park uh male velociraptor and with just the spines and that and this this figure here guys mattel this was so this was so underrated and um they really went all out with the detail on this and I'm so excited to do an unboxing with you guys with this one today. And we're just going to dive right in there and look at it. And just see. And I will be posting the links for this this uh, product um, in here. So, guys, it will be in the description. So, if you're still needing to add this to your collection, the link will be in here for it. And uh, I'm, just, I'm just excited to see what this guy looks like out of the package. So let's just dive right in. We cut that tape. We've got this insert here. Pop that back. You guys can see I just slid that plastic out of the way. So let's just set the box there. Take a good glimpse of it with the amber. Slide that guy right out. And then we can see the clips right away. We'll just start clipping this guy out. Now this was one of the last Amber Collection figures released because Mattel really just stopped doing stuff with it and then focused in uh, towards the end of 2021. Um, I think they were just going to start focusing on the Hammond Collection coming out for this year. In which I was sort of hoping they would have carried on more with this uh, Amber Collection because this was like the premium line of figures and you know the greatest... I, I think they were just such a great detail. But one thing that was really hard for us to find here in Montana is, is a lot of the stores did not carry the Hammond Collection. Or the Amber Collection, sorry guys. So I'm going, let's go ahead and get this guy out of here if it will be released. Let's see. There we go. And let's just take the uh, plastic off there, set this guy, and we can go ahead and pull this amber mat out. Go ahead and set that there. And let's just let's just take a look at this, guys. See in all detail, man. Just looking at this guy, this is this is the wicked raptor. This is this is the one. Now maybe they'll re-release this and do it in the. Uh, the Hammond collection, but let's see. I'm just gonna get this guy to stand and let's just go right in on it. Do some in-depth shots for you. All filmed in 4K, just look at the detail. Look at the paint, look at that detail. Look at the eye. And we'll go through all the poses that you can do. And the tail, you saw I did adjust. It is bendable, it is rubber. So you can do that and then there's a mouth, seeing the sculpt, just the paint job on this is just so awesome and so amazing. Just looking at this and thinking back to the uh, 
the Jurassic Park 3 React Attack Velociraptor. I have that guy and I remember that was like the raptor that changed the, the look of all the raptors when that came out. And now I'm thinking this is the one that changed the raptors moving forward. So let's just go ahead and um, get this mounted in there and just set that to the side for now. But you can see the mouth close is just awesome. So I'll bring that in. You guys can see that. Just look at that. Look at how it lines up. This is this is definitely one to add to the collection. You can move the mouth up higher. So double articulation. Open that. Open the jaw up super wide. Look at that. And then you can move the arms out. And adjust the legs. This is basically, guys, and like I said, we just did an unboxing of the uh uh amber collection the tiger velociraptor from the lost world and i have to admit like i'm a big fan of this amber collection i was like i said i was late to the party to do videos on this and i think these are these are the best raptors that have been done i like that they're six inches so they scale up and they scale with the super colossals in a way and these are basically, it's the, these are just the bigger version of the Hammond collection. So if people say, hand, you know, the Hammond collection's a whole different, they're the same articulation. It's just the Hammond, the Hammond collection scaled to fit with the regular Jurassic Park and Jurassic World uh, vehicles and figures and dinosaurs, whereas these guys are scaled, you know, to sort of go with the Super Colossals, if you ask me. But, um, just looking at that, you can see. And let's just set him on a stand. And then I'll show you guys. Um, so, you can really see the the detail in that. This is definitely one that you want to add to your add to your collection. And like I said, we will be posting the links in the video. And this is this is the one. And you know, think of it this way. This is uh, this is what we had to start with. In 2001 and this is what we wind up with in 2021 so 20 years later you can really see the difference in these figures and just really see how far Mattel has taken the Jurassic Park and Jurassic World line and they've just they've just knocked it out of the park you know these uh looking at the Velociraptor you can just see um the detail that even Hasbro was trying to do back back in the day, but you couldn't open and close the jaws. You couldn't do any of that. They came usually with one action feature, which was moving the arms. And now Mattel's giving you any which way you can pose it and close its mouth, make it make it very uh, photo, uh, get those great action photo shots in there. And you know, like I just look at this and I'm just like, this this Raptor is just amazing. Um, just just totally awesome so you can see that you know what 20 years has brought to the the toy line and you know and you can even see here's the uh the lost world tiger velociraptor that we just did our review on last week and you can really just see what Mattel has, has gone with. I I highly recommend guys to get these uh get these amber collection figures added to your collection before you can't find them anymore. I know that Mattel is not doing those anymore, but one other feature I forgot to go over with this is you can move the the talons, which I think that is amazing. You can't even do that on the uh Hammond collection guys. So knowing that you can move the claws up and down is just just amazing but i just i want to do this unboxing today guys in this review and i give mattel a 10 out of a 10 out of 10 on this this is hands down the best raptor that's ever been released and i mean like i love don't get me wrong i love the the lost world tiger raptor i mean that's a 10 out of 10 too because they've got the paint the paint detail down and just the articulation but i uh i have to say that from what we started with 20 years ago to where we are 20 years now look at it and just see um 
what do you guys think? Do you guys do you guys like this Jurassic Park three Velociraptor? Was it your favorite Raptor that was ever released? Um, I just want to know your guys' thoughts and comments on there. And I just want to say thank you so much for uh, following us and subscribing to us and uh, checking out our website. Just be sure, guys, uh, if you're not subscribed, subscribe to our channel and follow us on Twitter at Rushers Toys. And make sure you check out our website. We are posting new toys on our website for you to purchase. Um, we uh, we have the new uh, Stranger Things. We have Star Wars and the Obi-Wan. And we also are adding jurassic world dominion toys to our website so you guys can go on there click those links and it's going to take you to those websites where you're able to order those toys we're just trying to help you guys find those toys to add to your collection and um we just want to help you guys out and thanks so much for watching this video have a great day